There are many different ways to modify the objects in a drawing. Uh, generally, the principle is that objects that are visible can be relocated, deleted, or modified. Many of the methods of modifying objects are quite intuitive, and I won't spend a lot of time here, but there are a, key, a few key features that are worth highlighting. Let us go to GeoStudio and open up the DXF file that we had created earlier, or rather the regions that we had imported from a DXF file. Once we have opened this file, we want to change some coordinates, change a group of coordinates, and then use draw points also to alter the coordinates of some points. Going to GeoStudio then and opening up the file that we had created earlier called import DXF file. It would appear it would appear that the person who created these regions or polygons in AutoCAD uh, meant the coordinates to be from 0 to 500. For some reason, the entire problem is offset by about 5 meters. If we go draw points and click at any one of these points here, at the left end, we see that the X coordinate is minus 5 meters. Uh, the same thing at the right, we see it's 495. We can shift this entire drawing over 5 meters by doing it several different ways. Let us turn off the axis and then we can say, and then we go modify objects and we can select all the visible objects and move all the objects five meters to the right. Clicking on move, so now we have moved the entire uh, group of regions. Now if we turn back on our axis, we see now that the nodes on the, or the points on the left are at zero and the points on the right are at 500. I am going to click undo to illustrate a point and zooming in on the uh, left extent of the regions we can say key in points and we can select all the points at the left end and we can alter the left points by typing in one value for all one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight points. If we type a, a zero in here for X and then tab out, we see that we have altered a group of points with the key in points and dialog box. Just to repeat and reinforce it, we could do the same at the right end, key in points, selecting all the points at the right end. We can type in here uh, 500, tabbing over, and we have moved the points at the ends. Now this uh, has only altered the ends of the problem not all of the other uh, po uh, points, somewhere between the ends. As a result, that may not be what is desirable, but it does illustrate the point that you can grab a group of objects and alter the group of objects in the key and points dialog box. I will again click undo, undo, zoom all objects, and in this case, we want to say modify objects 
again moving the entire drawing five meters to the right. Modify Modify objects. Previously, I forgot to select all and type in five. We'll move over the entire drawing to the right by five meters. Again, bringing our axis back, we see now that the x coordinate on the left is at zero and the x coordinate on the right is at 500. It also appears that most of the points, particularly at, on the left and right extents, all have a coordinate of 60.1, for example. They all have a point one. View object information. Looking at these points, we see that it's 60.1, 55.1, fifteen point one and so forth. The same thing on the right end. They all seem to have the point one and perhaps that was not the intention but once again we can move the entire drawing down point one of a meter turning off our axis saying modify objects select all the objects this time we want to move the drawing down saying 0 minus, moving it down, minus 0 0.1 and say move and now when we say view object information clicking on the points they are all even units. So there are just a few uh, means of modifying uh, groups of points or groups of objects. Uh, as I mentioned just at the start of this session a few minutes ago, all of the other uh, procedures for modifying individual objects, uh, selecting the object, dragging the object, all of that is rather intuitive. I wanted to just highlight here some uh, mechanisms of modifying the problem which are probably not that clear and obvious when you first start with this. So I will leave modify object at this point and at this stage and move on to another topic.